Washington County Justices of the Peace are postponing a discussion about expanding the overcrowded detention center. The JP say they need more information before backing a proposed sales tax funding plan that would pay for the construction. Good evening. Thanks for joining us. I'm Chelsea Helms. Fox 24's Peyton Yeager was at the Jails and Law Enforcement Committee meeting tonight and joins us outside the Washington County Courthouse. Peyton. That's right, Chelsea. The committee decided to table the proposal of that sales tax plan to the March committee meeting. The Washington County Sheriff's Department brought a detailed report tonight to show the committee it's seeing a serious overcrowding issue. They even have inmates sleeping on the floor, and the Sheriff's Department is having trouble covering that cost of overcrowding. Now, that proposal would consist of a $38 million jail expansion plus an $11 million communication system. The bond issue calls for a one half percent sales tax increase to pay for the construction of a new jail. A separate one-half percent sales tax would be added to install the communication system. When both of these projects are completed, a quarter percent sales tax would remain in order to maintain the cost of the jail. It's a decision the courts committee is not ready to bring to the quorum court and it's not ready to bring to the voters of Washington County. It seems to me like this just came out of, uh, just came up recently, and even though the sheriff says it's been going on, I just think we need to step back and uh, view all the options. There's a lot of other things we could do besides just expand the jail, and that's what I was talking about tonight, and I, that's what I gave the quorum core to the committee members with some options that we need to follow to before we just jump in. And I get frustrated because this discussion has been going on publicly, in front of the public, in public forums for over four years. I've talked to civic or organizations I've spoken publicly here to really tell them that we this is not a new crisis that we're in it's only ramped up because Springdale is going to close their jail in less than a year we're already releasing nonviolent offenders misdemeanors at the rate of 200 plus a month now, Chelsea, within the next month, the JPs plan to continue to tour the jail to get some more information as well as meet with the full quorum court. And they hope to have a public forum with the homeowners in Washington County to get that information out there. We're live in Fayetteville, Peyton Yeager, Fox 24 News. Peyton.